Welcome back to the channel. Let us pull a white shirt look together. This was my look from two Sundays ago and I decided to show us because in my opinion, it slapped. It is a white shirt look. On this channel, I have a video where I styled maxi shirts, maxi white shirt in various ways. So you might want to check that out. It's the last video on the channel. Today, again, we'll be styling a white shirt, but a more fitted one. So stay tuned if you want to see it. How are you? How have you been? Let me know in the comment section. This is the shirt that I um, wore for the look. It is my size. It is fitted on me. So, so let's build on it. These are the pants options that I have or that I um, considered on that day. This striped denim pants and this um, black tailored pants. Uh, I'm, I am going to show us the both of them, but why I didn't go for this one was because I thought it was going to be expected. Of course, black and white, everybody does that or can do that. And it is going to be less challenging to style. But this one with the color running on it, though they are regular denim colors, but you would have to do a little extra work to be able to style this one. And I feel like... I have been wearing this one for a long time on this channel and i don't think i've done anything with this pant so i decided to um go with this so let me put it on let's see how it's looking so this is it uh, paired with the shirts how is it looking what do we think of course i'm going to talk in so i am going to do that right away see i told you guys everything looks better when it is tucked in look at how i solved the problem of um too much fabric having to deal with all of that there are looks you can do with with that but i'm a talking girl first before i'm any other thing so this is a tucked in so let stay tuned we we are going somewhere these are the jacket options that i have this one is a tailored papa's jacket that we have seen on this channel since day one and this one is denim is is a denim maxi jacket i think this is men's wear it is handless it is very oversized both of them are actually oversized so i wanted to do this i decided against it maybe because again overuse <laughs> or i have done so much look with this and uh the sleeves are very long and it was quite hot on that day i decided to do this i went for this one instead because denim on denim and i hadn't done any look with this on this channel yeah i figured it was going with the vibe or it wasn't going with the vibe because a white shirt and a men's wear denim jacket they are not exactly on the same page but this is fashion anything goes let us try on the both of them and see how they look but before all of that i wore a waistcoat because i wanted there to be a break in color between the black and the white i felt it was too harsh so i layered this dark blue with a touch of red waistcoat on it i need to get more waistcoats because the last time i checked they were ridiculously pricey so no i need to make new waistcoat so look out for that let us layer it under the jackets and see what we find i would have belted this the pants on the shirt if i wasn't wearing a waistcoat because you can see that it covers that area very well so i fi figured that there is no need for a belt if i belt across this thing of course in a contrasting belt color you will find that the look somehow becomes better somehow becomes more thought through but wearing wearing something like this sometimes it slaps but not all the time but in this case my waistcoat is going to cover it up and i wouldn't have to think about that it's coming together right do we like how it's looking already i feel um the color combination i haven't done much color combination but 
this you can look at it and you won't be confused right right let us layer the jackets this is the first jacket option i like it it is giving three piece suits and of course um black there is not much that i have done color wise but i didn't go for this and i ditched it because it was kind of hot that day but if i had actually wanted to wear this the weather wasn't going to stop me i figured that i had my mind set on the denim but this is cute but that's not what i wore so let us see the denim option first of all what i like about this is that my white shirt is speaking through here i liked that very much I, I think it's a very nice contrast because not much of the white shirt is showing inside because of the waistcoat and also denim on denim it is always going to be a vibe it will forever be a vibe so this is what i went for and um, again in the same color i haven't done anything outside the box with the colors so compared to the other jackets this is kind of um, a step down in that it is looking more casual than the first one but that's what i did and um yeah there is enough room to move around and do whatever and it is not going to be too hot in this now because i went with this jacket i figured that now i have to accessorize and accessorize i already like the button detail yes cutesy detailed and all of that but i think i am going to add some of my own so let me do that and get back to you accessories make the outfit take it from me you can have on the sleekest of wears or the most beautiful thing and without accessories i feel you won't really really see the potential or reach the potential of that outfit and i don't think there is anything as too much accessories never so what i have done is put on my wristwatch and a bracelet more bracelets because you can never wear too much and i've also buttoned my shirt all the way to the top i think this thing uh, this simple exercise is a way of accessorizing in my opinion and i have added my cowboy necktie uh lapel pins because why not the jacket was literally begging for it and uh what do we think do you like it whenever you have anything on i tell you accessorize you will see the difference it makes and something else that i have done is use my bag chain this is a chain from one of my handbags that i have used to do so many things another thing that you can do for yourself in fashion is to wear things the wrong way mm. the wrong way so that is something else you can do so what i have done is rolled it up uh, four times i put it into on this button right here this is a false button lapel and buttoned it up oh yeah how do we like it moving on let us talk about the footwear and i think that would bring the, oh and the handbag and that would bring us to the end of this video for my footwear i went with my bedazzled pointed stiletto I wanted to pull out the least color on my waistcoat, which happens to be the red. And um, that is what I chose for my footwear. And I added, and I added a pair of stockings. I don't know why I did that. This, that Sunday was actually the first time I was pairing stockings with heels. But I had seen it before somewhere and it just came to me to try it out and I liked it for my handbags i had two options this one or this one this one because my shoes and also is the least color in my entire outfit and this one because of the jacket and because it goes with everything but i didn't go with this because it wasn't co cooperating with my shoes i had already decided to wear these heels and I wanted um, to pair with a red bag as well, but the both colors decided 
not today. So I ditched the bag. I wore the shoes and my black bag. And this is the final look. Do we like it? What do you think about it? Now, if you look at this outfit, you may not see the red in my waistcoat that I decided to match my shoes with. So let us just call the heels a pop of color in the outfits. Yeah, I think that is another way you can look at it. And also the downside of stockings and heels is that your feet is going to be sliding to the front and that may cause some discomfort, but I'm sure that there are accessories for that. There are heels accessories to eliminate this problem. That was what I thought on Sunday before I put this outfit together. What do we think about it? Would you have gone for the, the, the other jacket or the other bag or something else? Let me know what you would have done differently. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Eva and my channel is on fashion. If you are a fashion girl, if you're interested in anything fashion related or styling and restyling your clothes, consider subscribing and give me a thumbs up so I can bring more videos like this your way. Thank you so much for stopping by. Have a good day now. Bye.